this is what women deal with. And I don't know if he was spying on men too, but you know, it, no. it's it's a reality, unfortunately, for us and something that I think about. But beach bum tanning members like Annie Schuler say to actually find out this man, Jake Gabler Kalati, has been charged with secretly recording them is deeply disturbing. Do you recognize that I guy? I do not recognize him, no. Wow, that's terrible. That's that's just disgusting. Nassau police say it happened to at least three to five victims across beach bum locations in Plainview, Levittown, and Seaford. The 22-year-old Gabler Colati was caught by a female customer March 12th, which led to his immediate arrest and kicked off the investigation. Currently, there are two unlawful surveillance charges pending, and police are trying to track down more victims. Basically taking his video camera, he would enter a tanning salon booth, he would place that video camera up on top of the ledge and videotape either the one uh, victim to the left or to the right in the other tanning booth. Police say Beach Bum did nothing wrong and their corporate spokesman says they are cooperating fully. Employees tell us they themselves fear they are going to be among the victims because free tanning is a perk. They say Gabler Kalati always struck them as strange, sometimes asking to change rooms in the middle of a session, a move that in hindsight looks like he might have been trying to find his next victim. He's obviously a pervert, you know? I mean, whatever gets your rocks off, I guess, but it shouldn't be at my expense. I always say do, have a, do whatever floats your boat as long as it don't sink mine. Well, that's sinking mine. We did go to the suspect's listed address. No one came to the door. If you do recognize him, we have the picture on social media. And at Pix11.com, go ahead and call Nassau County Police. Live in Levittown, Henry Rossoff, Pix11 News.